so hello and welcome back to my channel so today i'm going to show you how i got these edges done if you're interested in seeing me perform this what i did here continue watching bye okay so we're going to start off with section and some of obviously your edges out anyways um so this is the gel that i'm using it is my gel obviously okay just going to apply some gel on each little small section of here that I have out there, the sidebends included. Yeah. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Now, how I do my edges, I try not to force my hair to go anyway. So, the way it naturally wants to grow out or fall out, or however you want to call it, that is what I do. Um, does it come out the same exact every time? No, but I like the hair. I like the hair to go where you want to go, right? So this piece here, he wanted to fall back and make a circle. So that's bad. Pulling back, and I made a circle, and then I brush you needing to go back, and you know, let the hair do what it want to do. But you kind of finesse with the hair. You know, you're working with him. You're working again. So you're working with him, right? So brush forward and then I keep the tail back. Try not to go so low down because then I'll be touching my eyebrows. I'm trying to make sure it stays flat and I also try and make the same thing on the other side. You know they're gonna look like sisters, may not be twins, but they can look like sisters. Alright, and you know, just keep checking the work to see if it is they, they look similar. I'll just brush the gel through the side bones and curl with my finger and that's it. This is the finished look. Now, what I like to do is let it air dry a little bit first before I put on my hair tie. 